Newcastle. He's going to referee a, a big match, and it's a pleasure to now welcome Scott Coleman into the commentary box. Scott, one of the country assistant coaches, and we thank you for joining us here. And that's a good run early on as the offload comes. And this should be a free-flowing match like the last one, Scott. Yeah, definitely, mate. It's uh, been some very good rugby out here at the country championships and, yeah, a lot of good talent. So it's great weather, open rugby, so it should be a good spectacle. Good run there by Peter Fitzsimons. No bandana on this one, though. <laughs> As they go short side. This central west side, of course, both sides playing to get into the top tier next year. Yeah. And who are the players we've got to watch out for here, Scott? Who are on, who's on your radar? Oh, mate, oh, everyone's in consideration, mate, everybody. But I uh, like the look at the nine that's come off the bench for him. Oh, good for tackle Central there. West. He's a, uh, yeah, quite a good nine, nippy and a pretty good service. And, of course, the home side here in New England. We're playing at the University of New England. Great facilities here. Yeah, it's spectacular ground. And, yeah, facilities are enormous. The uh, fullback for the New England side's quite a quick fella and goes quite well. Oh, the little chip comes in behind. New England do. Noon had a, uh, a meeting and then, yeah, been here ever since. Six games of footy. Yesterday was a long day. I bet that meeting was a long one Friday night too. Ah, short and sweet, mate. Short and sweet. Quick feed and off the bed we went. Very good. Professional <laughs> in the country here. There's the, the little badge. Tom Green. Oh, Here's the dummy up the sideline. Oh, it's too easy there. Uh, it's Corv. He's over. Off the right. 